I attended Ball State uh, in the early to mid 60s. It was a very special time, a very active time socially across the country. Ball State had its own culture. We were all very close and we were close with faculty and administration as well. Everybody knew everyone. They allowed us to be the young people that we were. They encouraged us uh, to become, you know, the responsible adults that we all became. At David Letterman uh, was a couple of doors over. We had great fun. We had Joyce DeWitt uh, from Three's Company was in the drama department. It's a, a time that I, I, I really cherished, you know, and uh, the university hasn't changed since then in that it's kept growing. I think keeping their uh, thumb on the pulse of what's going on with commerce, with education, and with the country in general. So um, I look forward to getting back, you know, and, and, and catching up you know, on what's transpired in the last, oh, 40 years or so since I've been there. And uh, we do collectible plates and stuff like that. We did all of this in our own shop here, doing all the molds and everything. Oh, really? Yeah. When I had the opportunity to meet uh, Arnie Flotten, uh, we were visiting uh, during a tour of the new art department and uh, uh, talking about things going on. And Arnie happened to mention, you know, how about uh, coming back to the university and sharing some of your experiences, you know, talking to the students. In fact, how about coming back and, and lecturing, you know, become a member of the faculty. And, uh, I thought, like, I need something else to do to fill my day. <laughs> but then on the other hand, I'm working with an analog cat in a digital age, okay? So for me, it was not only having the opportunity maybe to share some of my experiences with, with the, these students, but uh, selfishly to have the opportunity to learn from them. I mean, I can talk about the skills that it takes, but how's it being applied today? So uh, I'm going to try to cover the whole gamut. We'll show a lot of pictures, show some animation, we'll do some drawing, and then we'll talk business and we'll talk about the future. It's going to be anything but boring and also it'll be laced with a lot of humor because that's what I do. <laughs> One of our mottos here is, are we having fun yet? So we're definitely going to have fun with this lecture series, if nothing else.